So I'm guessing that you want to add DLCs to your Sims 4 game. If you've seen any videos like this, or this, some of you guys are asking me. or this one, those are all my videos on TikTok. And I feel like a lot of you guys are interested in how to add DLCs to your Sims 4 on Steam Deck. So I was like, let me just put you guys on and actually just show you a full YouTube video on how to do it. First, you want to go to desktop mode. You want to go to Firefox, download an ad blocker. This is vital. You need an ad blocker, okay? Or shit's just not going to work correctly, okay? You're going to get bare ads if you don't download the ad blocker. So just download a free one. They're all free on Firefox. Next, you want to type in Ana, Anidas or Anidas. I think that's how you pronounce it. You want to click the instructions page like that. Then go to Linux, because obviously you're on Linux software, it's a Steam Deck. Then you want to click, I have the Sims 4 installed. I already have it installed. I I can't show you every which way and how, I can just show you the way I did it. I also have Sims 4 installed on Steam, so I don't know how to do it on EA. This is more for people that installed it on Steam. Then click, I have the Sims 4 installed. I don't know how to do it if you don't have it installed already. Always just have it installed in the beginning. Then click on, I have the legit version. It's the same for EA and Steam for the most part for the download and the DLCs. So let's just click that. Then you want to go to the DLC page only first. Okay, scroll down. I did it through, um, you can do it through GoFile or Bus Heavier. I think I did it through GoFile. And then you have to go past the security check. It's the one that has the open circle. Then just download your DLCs. I already have all of these downloaded, but just take your time, download all your DLCs. And then once you've downloaded all your DLCs, extract them all. You can also download your DLCs through the EA updater. I just did it through individual DLCs because at the time when I did this, the EA updater was down. So if it's ever down, just follow this. But it's running now, so you can just download the EA updater and go through the steps. Then go to Steam, where you have all your games. Right here, double click that. Go to your library. Go to Sims. My Sims 4 is updating right now. Okay. Next, you want to go to manage, then you want to go to browse local files. You want to drop all your DLCs in this local files. You see, I got all my DLCs already here. OK, so just drop all your DLCs into this. Don't open nothing new. Just drop them all here and they should have the name on it. So it should say Sims 4 DLC SP24 Fashion Street Kit, because before down here, I have DLCs downloaded, but it's just the numbers. It's not the right ones. It needs to say the name. This is the EA DLC Unlocker page. Download this, okay? Yeah, you see EA DLC Unlocker. I have it here, right? You're going to extract that, but you're going to extract it in Terminal. Okay, so I've included screenshots of what it would look like in Terminal when you open it up. Um, these are the commands that I put into Terminal. I'm going to go over this again. This is just a screenshot of what it should look like, okay? Uh, just follow the steps. Uh, once you've downloaded the DLC unlocker, extract it and then open it in terminal. OK, to open it in terminal, you have to click on it. So it should be highlighted like this, how it has a pink highlight on my one. I've customized it to be pink. I said to highlight the EA unlocker, but actually open it. Open that file and then click the setup Linux BH. That's the one that you need to be highlighted and then open it in terminal. OK. Because I don't want you guys to be confused. You click the hamburger. You click open and terminal. Now, I don't really want to do that right now because I don't want to mess up my game. <laughs> but um, I'm just going to show you with a random CC pack what terminal looks like. So you will open it like this. Open and terminal. And you see you got your terminal open here. So it should just be a black box that has like a cash sign. But when you when you open it in terminal, look, my one says downloads here, yeah? When you open it in terminal, it should say EA DLC unlocker. If it doesn't say that, you haven't opened it up correctly. So instead of downloads, it should say EA DLC unlocker, okay? When you write the commands that I'm going to put up on the screen now, I'm going to put up step one command and the step two command, okay? If you write the command and it doesn't work or it doesn't open correctly, you haven't opened terminal correctly. So you need to highlight 
the EA DLC unlocker here properly. That's why it's not opening, okay? So you just put in the first one, it should say Commod plus X setup Linux dot SH, okay? Once you write that, well, once you run that command, okay, it should say like, it should just come up like blank, like, okay, cool, it's gone through. And then run the second command that I've put up on screen. So I've put step one and step two. So just follow that and it should download your DLCs correctly. Now I'll show you my DLCs. I already got my game sorted. Um, Just to show you that I like, <laughs> I know what the fuck I'm talking about guys, like. Okay, so it's now the next day. Sims 4 is finally opening. I was having some troubles last night when I was trying to show you the video because the base game actually updated on the 18th. So I had to move all my mods. I had to move all my saved game files, my tray, um, so I can like just save my entire game. I had to move all of my, um, what's it called? DLC downloads and then delete the game entirely, re-download the game, put all my files back into the places that they should, back into the places that they should be in. And now it's going to open, okay? I was literally stressed the fuck out. Like, I was like, why does Sims keep updating the game? And then it's just ruining it for everyone. Like, imagine I was on a flight and I wanted to play Sims and I can't play Sims now because they updated the fucking game. Like, be so for real. Be so for real. I know that they gave an update. Like, when I opened it again, see here? When I opened it again, it did say, oh, yeah, there's an update on September 18th. But, like... Obviously, I can't see it if the game won't even open because it keeps crashing. But anyways, don't worry about that. Um, let me show you that everything, well, all the DLCs are loaded. So these are all my mods. I had to add all my mods back. I'm not even sure if I added all of them back. So my game might be looking dumb now. But either way, this is some of my DLCs. So I got the Get to Work one. I got X. I'm actually party stuff. Perfect fire stuff, spa day, cool kitchen stuff, spooky stuff, get together, uh, movie hangout, romantic garden stuff, yeah, okay, let me just get just like city living, um, vampires, bowling, parenthood, fitness, toddler, cats and dogs, laundry, my first pet, seasons, get famous, stranger veil, island living, yeah, so all my DLCs are added now, okay, um, again, whenever there's an update, just drag and drop all your DLCs back into Sims, and then, um, open up your EA DLC unlocker again, and it should be good, because that's what I just did, I was stressing out, but everything came back in one piece, this thing ever. Okay, 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 okay. Um, can I come off this now? I'm really tired of clicking. Oh my gosh, how many did I want to install? I was not playing. I was like, oh, you think you can fuck with me, Sims? I just downloaded all your DLCs, the fuck? Don't play with me about an update. Like, that's going to be anything. Let's go to store. So see, it says owned. Owned, owned, owned. If it doesn't say that, then I don't think you've downloaded it correctly. And I have some that I don't think I have here. Oh yeah, it says owned. Owned. Yep. And also, if you guys want to add mods, I'm going to put the list of file... How do I say this? The file directory that you need to follow to add the mods, I'm going to put it here. So, yeah, just follow that. Like, go into your files, go to home click dot local and then just follow the steps and that should be how you download your mods okay i hope you guys enjoyed this video i make fashion content and i also stream so hit the subscribe button because i will be back i stream roblox minecraft i'm um, dressed to impress so if you're interested in any of those games hit the subscribe button because i will be back and i stream like almost every day so um on youtube and twitch so yeah, stay tuned. Bye. So some of you guys are asking me how to add DLCs in The Sims 4. So first, go to this site and download all your DLCs from here. The download page should look like this. Um, download Firefox, also download the ad blocker so you don't get better ads. Once you download all your DLCs, extract them. Then go to Steam, go to Manage, and then open um, Local Files. This is where you want to drop all your DLCs. My DLCs are already in here. Once that's done, you want to download the DLC Unlocker. You should extract it, it should look like that. Then open that file in Terminal, like highlight the file and then open it in Terminal. This is really important if you're on Linux. 
I'm gonna put the code on the screen to unlock the DLC unlocker now for the Linux. Um, you have to do it through the terminal. This is the best way that I found to do it anyways. It didn't work any other way. Like how Windows, you can just open it. It doesn't work like that on the, the Linux software. So run the command, follow the normal steps, and then it should unlock.